You might have heard of companies acquiring businesses that operate in other sectors. This is called diversification. But some of the businesses fail to manage their diversification because the following two reasons, which is pointed out by Peter Lynch in his book, One Upon Wall Street. Number one, overpriced acquisition. And number two, buying out businesses that lie beyond their area of understanding and expertise. Let us try to understand the failed diversifications through an example. First one is due to overpaid acquisition. Mobile oil, oil industry in the 1980s. Don't confuse with Exxon Mobil, okay? So it overpaid for the acquisition of Superior Oil, which was around $5.7 billion in March 1984. This blew a lot of companies' cash reserves at once. As a result, during the peak in oil prices of 1980s, mobile oil's stock price grew by 10% and on the other hand, Exxon's stock price and another oil industry doubled in 1980s. Second example of failed diversification that takes place when companies acquire businesses that lie beyond their area of understanding and expertise. Genesco was a shoe manufacturing firm that made 150 acquisitions between 1956 and 1973 period. That included businesses in textile, women's jewelry, security consulting, etc. As a result, its stock price kept falling after 1973, despite getting bigger and bigger in assets. On the other hand, stock price of Melville, another shoe manufacturing firm, kept rising after 1973 because it acquired similar businesses related to discount retail. 